Mr. Speaker, I rise today to speak about the tragic and shocking turn of events in Nigeria, where as, as many as 300 girls have been, uh, young girls have been abducted by a terrorist organization known as Buku Haram. Uh, as, as, as a father, I can't imagine the anguish that these parents must be feeling uh, as they wonder about what happened uh, to their young girls. Uh, I stand in solidarity with the people of Nigeria in this difficult time and condemn the violence against innocent people committed by Buku Haram and urge that all possible actions be taken uh, and that President Jonathan uh, finally do something about the terrorists and the, and the uh, thugs that uh, seem to be ruling the country. Uh, too often women and young girls are tragically persecuted, victimized, or denied education opportunities uh, and do a voice, uh, particularly uh, in these countries, based only on their gender. Uh, the violence and discrimination has no place in our world today. Uh, today I will be joining my fellow uh, colleagues and uh, urging them uh, to sign on to House Resolution 573 to condemn this heinous abduction uh, and supporting all efforts to find these girls and bring them home. I yield back. Gentleman yields back. For what